Hey what's up everyone, it's Lauren and for today's video we are back with the Indian Drugstore makeup releases for the week. It is Saturday and I'm very excited to do this video. It was kind of a slow week, I'm not gonna lie. There weren't as many makeup releases coming out, not until like the end of the week. That's when really stuff started pumping out, like I'm not gonna lie. Makeup brands were putting out more stuff and I was like, oh, I had to catch up. I was kind of just forgetting about them for a second. So we got some good stuff in here. I'm really excited. I'm really excited. <laughs> and I'm really excited to show you guys what's been going on this week. So on this channel, we like indie makeup. We like drugstore makeup. We like a little bit of high-end makeup. We like to chat about makeup. We like to do makeup. We like neutral makeup and we love colorful makeup up in here. So if you're into that, please hit the subscribe button down below. Click the like button for this video and let's get started. So I scooted over, I'm trying a new thing where I scoot to this side instead of this side. I don't know, we'll see if it works. We'll see if it works. I'm, I think I'm liking it more. It's just easier than, I don't know, before I guess. <laughs> so let's get started with our first product. Carla Cosmetics is releasing six new pastel duochrome loose eyeshadows. So this is just one of them, one of the shades. They're available today, GMT, 4AM CST, and 5AM EST. So, Saturday, today, they're available. <sighs> listen, listen, oh my goodness. Carla Cosmetics. Man, already coming in with a win. That's just beautiful. Also, the quality of the picture, stunning. I'm really liking these. It's like a blue, green to gold. That's not even a duochrome, really. That's like a multi-chrome. I mean, they're calling it a duochrome, but I could see like a multi-chrome a little bit in there, you know what I mean? And that's, and they're pastels. Okay, so obviously I have to check out Carla Cosmetics and see what they're up to and what's going on because we're just, we're just there. <laughs> already, first product of the video and we're just already, we're just going to that website and they're just stunning. They are stunning. Next up, Milani coming out with the Gilded Getaway Eyeshadow Palette. It's 1999 with 12 shades, 6 matte, 6 shimmer, and eyeshadow sticks for $6.99, 4 of them. It's available now at Ulta Beauty. So this is cute, and I'm, you know, it's it's cute. The eyeshadow sticks are nice. They're more like neutral tones and stuff. That's pretty cute. It's, I mean, I'm not, I'm not the biggest fan of this. I don't know why the palette doesn't call to me in any way. It's just, it's just not for me, I don't think. And also, I don't really like the shape of the palette. I don't know what I do with it. Like, it's just kind of awkward. A little bit. Just a little bit. But I mean, if this is your color story, your vibe, I say you get it now while you can. Because I know there's some people that are going to be really vibing with this and they're going to pick it up. Also, shadow sticks seem to be coming back in style, and I think that's so funny because they used to be really popular, and now they're coming back. Next up, Endangered, Endangered Cosmetics is the Red Panda Pressed Powder Palette, 10 shades, mattes, and shimmers, available now for $46.74. Whoa! So, I mean... It's a cute palette, like it's definitely got that like red tones too with those orangey and yellow shades. And I like, I really like the panda. I love red pandas. I love them. So, 
that would be that draws me in immediately also endangered cosmetics that seems like a really i've never heard of them before i'm not gonna lie like gotta be honest so this is my first time hearing about them this is my first time seeing them and i like the palette 46 dollars though like it depends on the size of the palette i think i don't know how big it is because of the picture nobody's holding it so i think if it were like a larger palette then i could see why it would be that much money but if it was smaller maybe not but also indie brand so i can understand like why you would have to charge more for things as, as it does cost a lot of money to make stuff so yeah just hitting a little bit on the price point there the more you know you know like costs a lot of money to make makeup you never you know i never thought about that before i'm not gonna lie and when you do a little bit of research and how much money it costs not that I want to make makeup, like that's, I'm not gonna lie, that's not my jam. But, whoa, that's a lot of money. <laughs> and I just, whoo, can't, I can't take it there. <laughs> okay, next product. Shop Alter Ego is introducing the Luster Charm Palette. It's available already. This is really pretty. Doesn't say how much it is, but... It sounds like people are already posting videos about it, so that's pretty neat. I actually really like this color story. And I like, so I'm a big shimmer person, I'm not gonna lie. And I like that there are a lot of shimmers in here, more than mattes. Like you have your, I'm pretty sure, how many mattes do you have in here? I'm thinking you maybe get four mattes top. That's, I think, based on the picture. I think that's how many you get and I don't mind that because I'm a big shimmer person like I use shimmer in every single one of my looks like I'm not against that at all like at all so I'm thinking based on the picture that's how many you're getting and this is really pretty it's like a mauvey brown palette I'm liking it a lot the next palette is really pretty it's by shy bear cosmetics it's their cottage dreamer eyeshadow palette and matte shimmer and one press glitter and it says it's inspired by Alice in Wonderland, The Hobbit, Beautiful Spring Days, and the game Stardew Valley and I thought this palette was so cute. It's coming soon so there's no price point, nothing like available for it yet. I thought this palette was so cute. It's the purple, browns, and then the cold bottom row greens just. I'm not the biggest fan of press glitters. I'm not gonna lie. I never use them at all like ever. So that would be like one thing, but there's only one, so, you know. But these is, this is like a beautiful palette. So that's definitely something to look forward to and don't know when it's coming out. So, yes. So this one's not, this is makeup news. I have a bit of makeup news in here, not quite makeup like releases. This is makeup news. So the Kaleidos Club Nebula eyeshadow palette will be back in stock. April 14th instead of in May, 8 p.m. PST, 10 p.m. CST, and 11 p.m. EST. And that's really exciting because a lot of people were a little bit upset that they didn't weren't able to get it like the first two times. So, and I know the site was having a bit of trouble keeping up. So this is like really exciting that they're able to restock it and they're able to do a whole other round. I wonder how long it'll be like how much of the stock they're making. That's something I do wonder. Next up, Hustle Bee Beauty. It's coming out with five new velvet liquid lipsticks. Available now for $12.99 each or $55 for the whole bundle. So these look like berry tones and like maybe a red on the end. And they're really pretty. And I actually really like the square packaging with the white lid. And they're just, yeah. I don't need any more lip products. I just got some more. <laughs> So I don't need any more like that, but definitely for $12.99, it's not a bad price at all. I think that's a pretty good price. So you could definitely pick those up and they look pretty nice. More lip products from Mel Trinity Co. They got new lip glosses in six shades. You got a clear, a peachy shimmer, a nude and orange, a mauve and a chocolate brown. Available already, $16 each. So these are really pretty. Again, I don't need any lip products, but I just, these are like really pretty. And I also do like the packaging because you do get to see the color. I don't know. I 
some lip packages you don't get to see the color of the lip product like they give that fake plastic coating so i like when they show the color i don't know that's something i do like they're 16 dollars so that's a okay price it's pretty good next up bh cosmetics is releasing their april birthstone collection it is already available and it's the diamond and honestly i actually like this palette i'm not gonna lie i am my birthday is not in april so and i don't think i'll be picking it up they're like super cheap though i don't remember how much it is it's like between it's like i think it's like nine bucks can't be more than ten dollars i know that for sure and i'm kind of waiting to see what my month is like i know what it's gonna be but i want to see what the palette's gonna be so i'm kind of excited and i already know i want a different month that they're also doing just because i really like the stone that they're doing a lot so i'll definitely be picking up that month i mean i really like what they did and i like that they made the bigger the biggest shade the actual like diamond shade almost like a highlighter so that way you could use it as a highlighter which is nice next up makeup revolution is doing a friends collab i believe this is again if not again then this is another friends collab because i don't remember if they've already done one or not because i did not buy from the friends collab so in this collection there's a lot there's a there's a lot going on in this collection let me tell you it's the forever flawless i'll be there for you eyeshadow palette which is 18 dollars forever flawless we are we were on a break eyeshadow palette also 18 dollars three nine pan eyeshadow palettes and joey chandler and ross 12 dollars a piece six sheet masks five dollars a piece or 14 dollars for a set of three joey is salicylic acid chandler's pink clay ross's tea tree oil rachel is hyaluronic acid monica's niacinamide phoebe is pineapple pineapple interesting three mini setting sprays eight dollars a piece and rachel monica and phoebe two packs of blending sponges twelve dollars a lobster mirror for fifteen dollars the door cosmetic bag for twelve dollars and you can get sets so the rachel says is 48 phoebe said is also 48 monica says 48 the lip gloss set is 36 dollars. the central perk set is 43 dollars. oh my goodness so listen i don't think this is needed i really don't you know what i think would have been cute is maybe if they had done the eyeshadow palette like the big one and then like the sponges or in the makeup bags and then that's like it you know like keeping it simple but there's so much going on like i don't even know what is happening and honestly the thing that lures me in the most is the mirror because it's a lobster it doesn't even have anything to do with friends it's just because it's a lobster yeah that's <laughs> that's it i don't understand why friends is so like i like i like friends i like the show a lot actually but i don't understand like why it's such a big why it's such a big deal i don't know a lot of people that actually watch friends i'm not gonna lie so to me this just seems a little much and i don't think i'll be buying anything from it but if you want to buy something i actually want to see somebody get the lobster mirror maybe the sponges yeah next up surreal makeup is coming out their spring solstice box set it comes with multi chrome flake toppers three solid colors and semi-solid colors and one highlight shade it's available now for 80 dollars it's a limited edition collection so i think that means it will not be around forever and honestly i would so snatch this up but i don't think i should right now just because i've gotten a lot of makeup recently so i'm trying to like be better but this is definitely something that I'm like into so I will have to keep my eye on surreal makeup because this is like stunning stuff this is stunning and I love how you can like build it up and there's the toppers that go on top and it just makes everything look so beautiful this is just so beautiful it's limited edition so gotta get it while you can give me glow cosmetics is coming out with new single eyeshadows 
So they're coming out with one new purple one, Toxic, which is the top one in the swatches. And honestly, that's really pretty. It's really pretty purple. And then they're coming out with all new, like these reddish coral shades in West Coast, Spiked Punch, Peach Glaze, and Baby Peach. And these are stunning too. I really like Peach Glaze. That's really pretty. Wow. This is like what I would make a palette with. <laughs> oh man. You know, I've had my eye on Give Me Glow Cosmetics. And they have great stuff coming like in their shop. And I just, ugh, I'm trying to be good. I'm trying to be good. It's good stuff. It's really good stuff. Okay, this one. I was so excited when it came out. I literally watched the swatch party for this palette. It's the Alien Cosmetics All I Ever Wanted Eyeshadow Palette with 20 duochrome shadows. It's available now for pre-order. The price is $86. Listen, you do not understand. <laughs> if I had known this was coming out, okay. So, so the price coming from a cheap person, it's a little much for me. But like I said, I'm a cheap person. But would I pay that? If they still, if this isn't a limited edition item and they keep it in stock for the next month or so, I will buy it. And I will make a video on it. Yes. In the next month or so. But I can't buy it right now because I've literally bought so much makeup, guys. You don't understand. I cannot buy this right now. And I'm so sad because I was watching the swatch party on Hayden Haunt's YouTube. It's so good. Also, ignore my red, my redness. I just scratched myself. It was so good. Like, the swatches, I mean, you can go by the picture. They're beautiful. Like, they are absolutely stunning. And the toppers, I want this. I'm not getting it right now, but I will get it eventually. I know that, and I will make a video on it. <laughs> So I'm excited. <laughs> I just can't get it right now, but I hope that they make it like a like a kind of permanent item enough to where I'm able to purchase it like later on. Elf Cosmetics is doing a collab with Jen Atkins hair, and yeah, I mean I wasn't expecting a collab so soon after like Chipotle, but they were fast. They're on it. They're ready. So in this collab, it's the Let's Elfing Do It palettes. It's $14 each. You get an all-in-one face and eye palette featuring four eyeshadows, one sun-kissed bronzer, one sheer matte blush, and one shimmery highlighter. So there's a light, medium palette, and a medium deep palette. And then the Jen Atkin Extra Lip Duos, $8 each or a kit for $20. 2-in-1 Lipstick and Liner Duo defines and enhances lips. Creamy formula, vibrant color with a rich and matte finish. In the shades Ready to Go, Self-Made Pink, and Bring It Brown. And then the other product, wow. The third products are the Hair and Brow Pomade for $6. The Mist Me for $8. And the Zero Effort Liners for $5 in Jet Set Black and Brown to Earth, and then the Eyes Up Here kit for $12. So the Eyes Up Here kit is the Zero Effort Eyeliner in Jet Black, Hair and Brow Pomade, and the Dual Ended Eyebrow Brush. Yeah, available April 5th on their website. So that's coming up pretty soon. If you guys are interested in that, I probably will not be picking up anything from this as nothing really pops out of me or anything, but that's really great. That's exciting. Seems like e.l.f. is really just like on it lately. They are they seem to be putting out really good products. So I'd be interested to see like what kind of these are. I'm not gonna lie. Alien Cosmetics has also released their new low light highlighter palette. It's available now for pre-order and the price is $48. So this is also really stunning. And I just gotta say it looks great on the skin. Also seen like swatches of it and actually seen Thumbnail of Alien Cosmetics wear it and it looks beautiful. So it's just, it's a great, it looks great. <laughs> it's another one that I like, but I honestly don't think I would get this simply because of the colors. Like I like 
the highlighters that I have and so I think I'll stick with those for a little bit. So more makeup news. The Tiny Marvels eyeshadow palette by Sydney Grace is coming back in stock. It's $52 and that's the collab that they did with Mel Thompson. It's really pretty and then also their Enduring Love eyeshadow palette is also coming back in stock. And they're coming back in stock Tuesday, April 6th at 9 a.m. PST, 11 a.m. CST, and 12 p.m. EST. So be on the lookout for those. I really like the Tiny Marvel eyeshadow palette, like the way it looks. So that would be interesting to get for sure. I know a lot of people actually really like the palette and they reach for it a lot. So it also would be a good spring palette, I feel like. Essence and Disney did a collab. And it's their Disney Princess Palette Collection. There's three palettes for $13.99. It's Aurora, Snow White, and Ariel. Ariel is not available. Available now at Ulta. What? What? My favorite one is not available. The Betrayal. <laughs> I was actually looking at these and I was like, Ariel is my favorite princess. Just putting that out there. This is also my favorite palette on there. And I was like... Well, you know, what if? And it's not even available. So the other two, Aurora and Snow White, are available at Ulta. You just can't get Ariel. Don't know why, but and they're $13.99. So you can check those out. They look pretty cute. Clarity Cosmetics is releasing loose pigments. The shade pictured is Kaleidoscope. Coming soon, so there's no info on it yet. That's really pretty and you can already see some of the shift in there, like a pinky blue a little bit. That's so stunning. I am- loose pigments are hard for me though because I don't own any glue and I don't really know how to use them. So I tend to stay away from them but they're so stunning and I know so many brands are coming out with them in like multi-chrome or dual chrome, like formulas. I don't know. That's really pretty though. It's Belle Cosmetics is coming out with another new product. And that's what it looks like, but we don't know the name of it or what exactly it is. It's just a sneak peek and it's coming soon. So that's pretty exciting. It looks beautiful. Wow. Like that's really pretty. Hmm. I mean, it's like an eyeshadow, like pigment kind of, but I wonder if it's gonna be like a multi-chrome or duochrome, like special. Trixie Cosmetics is back with the Insider 2.0 collection. And it's available already. So it's Cherry Chip is a buttercream lipstick. Eden is a matte lipstick. And Marsha 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 is a sheer lip gloss. These are really pretty. Like, I really like Eden is the matte lipstick, which is up in the corner. That's really pretty. Wow. Those look really nice. Those look really stunning. Wow. That's really exciting. Pulse Beauty is coming out with new products. Their Miami Night Highlighter Palette has six shades, and then their Sunset Glow Contour Palette also has six shades, and they're coming out with 15 piece eyeshadow blending brushes. Those look really nice. I don't think I need any highlighter palettes, or I don't need a contour palette. I'm barely getting into bronzing. I can only imagine how much of a mess I would be if I contoured. I don't even want to think about it, honestly, like, it's so bad. So I'm actually like staying away from highlighter palettes right now as I'm not even using mine really. But be interested in their brushes for sure. And that's really cool they're coming out with more products and I like the packaging a lot. It's really cute. I like it. So Pulse Beauty was my last beauty brand and product and that was it. It was a pretty fast week. There weren't as many makeup releases as I thought there would be. Like sometimes I feel like I have like 40 or 30 products I feel like I could talk about. And this week there just weren't as many like indie brand or drugstore brands to talk about that were like releasing stuff that I caught anyways. Like I could be missing stuff. And honestly, I try so hard not to, <laughs> but I could be. And I'm hoping I get most of them at least and show you guys like some pretty good stuff. So yes, those were all the products. And I feel like it was actually a pretty good week, even though there weren't as many. Like we got some makeup news and there's some restocks. And we also got some pretty cool like duochromes and like toppers and multi-chromes. And we got that Alien Cosmetics palette that's already out. 
and I saw that it's almost gone. <sighs> I'm not getting it, but I hope that it stays for a little while so I can get it. You know, because I know they do pre-orders for the month, so I'm hoping they can do something like that and I can order it like a month in advance, something like that. Because I really do want to try it and then I can make a video about it and I think that would be really exciting. So, so that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know I actually really did seeing some of these new products and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!